Bandit Keith in America. If anybody doesn't get that reference, it's uh, from Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged, which I completely endorse, and uh, it's just hilarious. You know, the series is still running strong by uh, Little Karibo, um, and Bandit Keith is kind of like a Hulk Hogan kind of character uh, that's fully um, obsessed with America and being American. Um, <laughs> it, it's a great series. You should check it out. Okay. So Bandit Keith gets to choose who goes first. And uh, lo and behold, he goes first. Okay, I don't have a great hand this time. It could be much, much better. Oh, he's gonna be running pendulums. Pendulums are um, pretty tricky cards. You know, it, it allows them to special summon so many times per turn and uh, adds monsters to their extra deck. Which you'll see probably in this duel. But I'm going to try and play this one safe a bit. Hopefully this works. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try to destroy the trap card. Or a spell, whatever it is. Okay, it was a spell. Good. Um I'll bring out Shekinaga. Yeah, Shadol Shekinaga is um El Shadol Shekinaga. Is uh Oh, I should have done that before. Okay. Eh, it's alright. Send these two to the grave, and I bring out the great El Shadol Shekinaga. Um, if I have a Shadol monster in my hand, which I do, and a special summon monster on the field activates its effect, I can just negate and destroy it by sending my, in this case, Shadol Dragon to the grave. So, yeah, it's a great card. I'm going to attack. In turn. Mill three. A, the, one of the best things about running this kind of deck is milling. Sending cards from my deck to the grave. Because most of my cards in my deck do have graveyard effects. Okay, he didn't do much. I'm gonna get beyond this. I have to find a way to attack without overextending myself again. Summon. Hopefully that works. Okay, good. Activate Ryan's effect. Send two cards to the grave. It was a Shadol Fusion and Raigeki, which I don't know why it's legal these days, but you know. Game's gone a lot faster. So, there you have it. Um, now's a good time for Crimson Blader. The Crimson Blader, not really a staple in my deck. In fact, I don't even use it today in my actual deck. But he has an awesome effect. As you can see here, if it destroys a monster by battle and sends it, sends it to the grave, my mon my uh, opponent can't normal or special summon five level five or higher monsters during their next turn. And okay, that that's completely broken. Um, I'm not going to lie about that. Let's see what happens. What? Couldn't attack it. Oh. Okay, so it can't be destroyed by battle. Um, let's see what happens. Oh, good. But he gets that back to his hand. Good. At least I got rid of it. Ah, Supply Squad. I used to run that card in my uh, Burning Abyss deck. If a monster you control is battle destroyed by battle or card effects, you can draw a card. 
So I was destroying my own monsters and getting the corresponding effect. It was just so good. So good. A glow bulb in here. Sweet. Well, do I have any shadows? I should all drag in. So I will flip summon and bring out Shadow Dragon in face down defense position. Okay. All right. The things I could do here. All right. I think it's safe to do this. Normal summon. No, especially some Goyo Guardian. Which nowadays, not a great card. It's at three on the banned list. Um, but now you have to use that Earth Tuner, I believe, and one or more non tuner monsters instead of just one tuner and one or more non tuners. Um, yeah. Okay. Let's see if this works. I got him first. Effect activates. And now he can't special summon or normal summon level 5 or higher monsters on his next turn. That helps me a lot. In case he has heavy monsters. Okay, so far I'm safe. Let's make sure I'm extra safe here. Okay. I don't want to do anything. Scrap. We just got add a scrap card to it from his deck to his hand. Okay. Face down card. Interesting. I could really use. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. I'm gonna flip. You should old dragon's second effect. Turn this card to his hand. And then I'm going to try to go for it. Will not overextend myself. I'll tag with Shakunaga. And I beat him. Okay. Ben Keith was not a great duelist in the show or in this game. 